Hello and welcome, it's KB here. So yeah, finally Microsoft made a PC optimization tool. Yes, PC cleaner, PC booster, whatever you want to call it. If you go to this website, pcmanager.microsoft.com, from here you can get this. I know it's in Chinese, looks like Microsoft's Chinese department is working on this, but we can easily translate this page just like that. So it looks like it's in beta version, Microsoft PC Manager 2.3. Let's go, simple and uh, okay, some of the texts are hidden. So this is also my first time trying this out. So let's download it. <laughs> okay, I'm excited for this. One click speed boost, full system security checkup, all right, and repair. So let's find out. I am actually excited for this. Finally, we don't have to use third-party apps. Now it's from the Microsoft and it should be fully trusted. Uh, it's been around three, maybe five minutes. It's still stuck at 32. Maybe it needs to download some files. So I'm just gonna wait a few more. Yeah, 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 yeah. now it's going up. <laughs> okay, 100% completed. Uh, launch now and this is the first look of Microsoft PC manager it opens uh, to the right side automatically but I believe you can move it wherever you want cool so main page is about cleanup boost your PC's performance we just have to click on this and we have a second tab where scan your PC for threats so it's like antivirus something browser protection Default browser, Microsoft Edge. I, I mean, I just use Microsoft Edge as my default browser because when I change it to something else, Microsoft Edge and my system keeps telling me I need to switch to the Microsoft Edge. So <laughs> I'm not gonna bother changing to anything else, but I do use Chrome as my main browser. Okay, let's click on this boost performance boosted. It took like one second. It cleaned around 900 megabytes in second very cool check your pc to protect your pc let's let's go through that Ooh. <laughs> potential issues reset default browser to edge okay i also read some uh, news articles online the, about this app everybody was saying that this app pc manager app is so aggressive towards uh, the default browser that it just keeps telling you that switch to the edge browser uh, which i am even if you are on edge you can see here my current default browser is the microsoft edge but uh, if i go here and check for health and it says that not set okay i'm just gonna do it proceed completed potential <laughs> threat or whatever it was all of them are gone what the hell is wrong with this i mean I, I clicked on set default to make the chrome default but it doesn't work <laughs> man i can't even change my browser to anything else it is so hard now okay whatever system itself is so crazy that you know it just blocks it just i don't know for some reason well I have to make a separate video for this. Okay, I'm gonna actually do this one more time. Cancel. Maybe some of the things changed. I'm gonna check for that again one more time. Okay, nothing changed actually. Nothing, nothing, nothing changed. <laughs> so basically, it is very aggressive. If you change your browser to something else, it's gonna force or it's gonna at least tell you that there is a potential issue. <laughs> you should switch to the edge. Okay, that's. Uh, I mean, I don't care which browser is my default. Storage management, uh, disk cleanup. I don't have to use any third party app anymore for cleaning stuffs. All right. This is actually cool. All right. Manage large files. Okay. We have that. Manage apps. It takes you to the app installed apps section from here. We need to uninstall it. Okay. Storage sense. Obviously, there is a feature called storage sense, which automatically you know cleans up your PC and whatnot. Uh, so, but it looks like it's actually good. Deep clean. I go deep, very deep. How about that? I'm gonna clean that. So for cleaning, it looks like it's it's good. It's good. 
and we have a process management all right i'm recording with the obs studio so obviously i don't want to end them but yeah okay let's do this thread scan it works just like microsoft uh, windows security the windows defender <laughs> uh, but it looks like it doesn't work with the windows security it's a separate thing it's a different thing it's doing its own thing so looking for key system locations startup apps basically it's repeating some of the things like startup apps browser extensions and okay never mind i got this notification that microsoft Def defender scan result found nothing it looks like the pc manager app is working with the Win windows security uh, you don't have to use windows security but uh, yeah yeah it looks like i'm pretty safe my pc is pretty safe <laughs> check for updates mm, okay it looks like windows update is also integrated here so these are actually driver updates uh, i believe there is no system update available right now yeah there is no system update so yeah but microsoft windows defender plus the windows update works within this application you don't have to use them and it is faster to use i mean just look at me i'm gonna open the windows security app it takes some time you know to open but this pc manager app is like faster and does the same thing what microsoft windows defender does maybe this is the reason i cannot uh, change the default browser i'm gonna disable this or maybe I can change it from here. Change default browser. Wow. Okay. Now I did that. Right. It's Chrome. All right. <laughs> okay. I'm going to scan for PC health check. Oh, yeah. It says potential issue. <laughs> Reset default browser to edge. Not set. I mean, I don't want Chrome to be my default browser actually. So uh, I'm just going to listen to this guy and I'm going to do that. Done. You know, the reason why I use Edge as my default browser is that if someone sends me a link, uh, I am, you know, maybe weird link, maybe some, you know, hacking link, whatever. Uh, I can open that on my PC with Microsoft Edge browser without any problem because I literally don't use any accounts or no, nothing like that on my Edge browser. There are some accounts that I do care, but, you know, it's very rare case that you're going to click on malicious links so just to be safe uh, i just use microsoft edge as my you know shield the protector it's still in beta maybe we will see more stuff added to this and uh, already i mean it looks amazing actually it does what it says all right and uh, one more thing uh, there is no registry cleaner maybe there is uh, it does it automatically without any option or no nothing like that who knows but it looks like there is no registry cleaning option and microsoft is also against cleaning the registries so it looks like using a registry cleaner is actually useless or maybe we will see that option in pc manager app in future who knows in my opinion microsoft is doing great by making this app because if you look online like pc cleaner pc boosters uh, something like that you'll find thousands of apps okay i'm not saying that those apps are bad or something like that but those are third party apps maybe some of them are really good but most of them are actually really bad <laughs> okay i'm not gonna go too deep into this but uh, yeah now we have a official pc optimization tool by microsoft which is simple easy just yeah and it looks amazing yeah <laughs> those are my final words for pc manager app if there is a, any huge update in the future uh, in this app i will also update a video i mean i'll make a new video on that but for now that's it hope you enjoyed it if you have any question or have any suggestions for me you can always do the comment yeah i will see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun bye bye